take off, take flight with you. For we never fly, but we're flying. So in true Ollie fashion, hey guys, welcome to episode 67. <laughs> no, first and foremost, happy new year. Happy, happy, happy new year. To every happy listener, new year. we made everyone it. Everyone watching, everyone listening, we wish you a very happy new year to you, your loved ones, and your family. It's 2021. Wow, a whole year has passed of a year we will never forget for many, many reasons. But nevertheless, we still move, we carry on, and we enter a new year, a new year of hope, new year of challenges, a new year of successes, a new year of some downs, but we recover, we'll rebound. We'll get on the highs a new year to be thankful to be grateful to be happy a new year of being healthy to grow in wisdom and to spend time with family friends and loved ones so yeah, happy man. new year wherever you are wherever you're celebrating so guys new yeah. year a different kind of christmas thanks to uh the uk <laughs> government a uh, one that we different kind of christmas different kind of christmas different kind of crimbo <laughs> But what can we say? The government's unpredictable. So has 2020. Mm -hmm. So we just have to be, like I said, Bruce Lee, be like water. So how did you guys spend the, the holiday season, the weeks um, that we've had? I, th I guess you've all had some sort of time off. So how have you spent it? Um, I could quickly start. So like Daniel said, we obviously received the announcement um, that we're going into tier three, no tier four, sorry which is crazy because I didn't even know tier four actually existed until it was announced is I saw this funny meme online where it was like, um, where you study for tier one, two and three, and then in the exam, <laughs> all of a sudden, <laughs> some random tier four comes up like you weren't even expected. So it was a surprise for everyone. Um, it was quite funny because my brother were planning to spend Christmas with his, um, with his, um, his um in-laws um so when the announcement came out he basically packed his kids <laughs> got in the car and drove all the way to Wigan because he only had a few hours before sort of the deadline so that was actually quite entertaining but for myself um I would say this has been a very relaxing holiday and Christmas um this is the first time in the last three years where I haven't been in what we class as like closing or heavy workload. So I changed roles. Um, I'm now in a project role, which for the guys that have listened <laughs> to projects are saving people's careers <laughs> and people's income. <laughs> so so just, just quickly, just quickly onto that one, yeah. I've actually, you know, it's funny. It's, <laughs> I've, actually, I've actually moved into a full-time role where where my, <laughs> what, is, what is this guy showing us? <laughs> I don't understand. Sure I don't understand. I don't understand. That. What's going on? I can't, I can't. <laughs> where where the, the title of one part of the title of my role is head project management <laughs> office. <laughs> <laughs> so we we making this permanent, B. I'll tell you it's beautiful. Projects you typically <laughs> during the holiday period, everyone is off. So um I got the time to really spend with family, relax, enjoy the holidays, re- refresh i think that's the key word for sort of this holiday is just being able to just relax take some time off take daytime naps which you don't always get and really just plan for 2021 which has been the beauty being able to just take that time to plan and recharge so that's me new year's not having a mad um celebration today um because there's not that much to do um but really planning for 2021 and all the travels and goals that I've set for the year. Nice. <laughs> no, I was just thinking there's not there's not much you can do as police will be on your doorstep. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead Shaw, you're next. <laughs> no, I think you go next. You no, go, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. How you, how, how's your holiday, man? <laughs> go, D, go ahead. Go next, go next. Why, why, why? Um, just go well, next, man. Just go next. I'm laughing too much. <laughs> uh, mine's been been okay. Um, taking some time off. I don't tend to take time off around the Christmas period unless I'm traveling I always feel that is somewhat a waste because it's never really intense at work so I try and save and carry those days over but because I'm really carrying over the maximum of 10 days I'm forced to set those four and a half days which I have left otherwise I lose them so Daniel you one of those people where you're strategic with your holiday when everyone else is 
taking a holiday and is less busy, you're working. <laughs> and when it's the yeah. crazy busy time, you're like, I'm off. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> no shame. No shame. No, 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 because unless I'm traveling for Christmas, unless I'm around, I always feel your days are shorter in the office. That's it's true. quiet. You get to do a lot of admin anyway that you wouldn't ordinarily be able to do or fit into your normal schedule. So it's been, it's, it's worked wonders for me. Mm. Um, so in that regard, that was it. And taking time off, resting, spending time at home, well, not much else I can do. The sport and football's kept me entertained with the, the fast and thick uh, fixtures coming in. So that's been quite useful and quite good. But apart from that, just um, just been at home, trying to stay um, healthy. And by the way, uh, for the people who get to see this on video, Daniel is looking fresh right now. Like, so sharp that when you look at him, you feel like your eyes are going to cut. So I guess I'm next. I guess you're next. <laughs> Wait, did you hear me? Yeah, I just, I just got back. No, could he? Could he, could he... Yeah, I just got, got off. Did it cut out? Back from... Yeah, no, it's, it's fine. I don't think you was you didn't say. I don't think you said. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! The thing is, because I lost, fine, I lost signal. Fine, fine. I, got a, I got a phone call. Then one. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh. Sure, I didn't say anything important. It's okay. It's cool. I didn't say anything. <laughs> no, I just, I just got back with the family um, from Dubai. I was out there shaking a leg on the beachfront, enjoying ourselves. Um, no, I wish there's actually there's there's a there's a hell of a lot of people in Dubai. Um, no, a so, for, so for me, for me, um, um, it's it's been a great break because it's basically been, been filled with um, family. When you're living overseas, you obviously get limited touch points throughout the year to spend time with family. So um, I've actually spent time with my in-laws, and it's been great just to literally have you know catch up over dinners, um, you know catch up in the afternoons. I've been able to get really good rest. So as Olu was talking about getting afternoon rest, which is key. I tend to sleep with Karim in his afternoon rest, so that's really cool. Um, but yeah, just resting, um, planning for next year. Um, I think we're going to obviously talk about it on another episode in terms of how we're approaching uh, 2021. But family, resting, and most importantly, gratitude. That was how the holiday went. So, sure. Yeah, I think I can just jump sure. on that. So I think gratitude's been um been a big one and also the rest piece as well. I think all of us are probably people who don't maybe rest enough. Um and I took three full weeks off work on the property That's side. I, I disagree with that. Don't you remember um Pabilo's episode on sleeping and the importance of rest? Yeah, that's true. That's true. But then do you still think we're resting enough though, or as much as we should? I think no. after P read that book, I think he became an expert. <laughs> this guy's throwing shots. I think if you look at if you look at some of the top athletes, okay, our work is not quite the same. I think um, there's an opportunity to get more rested, but not necessarily Always. throughout the night. I think throughout the day. Mm. Um, but if you'd read that book, rest that I done a book review on, you would know the different techniques that you can use to rest. <laughs> but anyways, but go ahead, sure, run that, run that. Go ahead. Well, no, go so go. all um, all all good. So I spent a, the Christmas period at home um majority of that in the uk been able to catch up with some friends of course within the restrictions that we're in at the moment and hopefully when this episode comes out i should be on a beach somewhere with crystal blue water and the clear blue sky but i'm not going to say where that place is just in case things don't work out and i'm still actually in the uk during that period but for now when we're recording this episode my flight is still planned for the 31st of December, and the airport hasn't closed, so let's see. Well, that's techie, boy. 31st of December. Well, it's a good break. Still hitting them, still doing exercise, uh, enjoying food with the family, and yeah. I haven't started with my 2021 goals yet, and I saw an email from, I think, Olu already shooting me his view for next year. I went through it and realised, boy, I need to start thinking soon. Um, but actually, when this episode comes out, I'll probably be spending the first week of January uh, away from laptops and just thinking about what I want to do in 2021, mm -hmm. which hopefully we release an episode very soon about it. For sure. Cool, guys. So, is this is this potentially our shortest, quickest, most efficient episode to get into the year? To be honest, if if we could do this every episode, Kabila would be happy. 
<laughs> no, I think we have recorded. I think there have been other times where we've recorded and it's cut out or something's happened. So we've had to either redo it or something along those lines. So this has not been our shortest. But no. I, think short, I think our shortest has been when someone was on the way to Reading to look at a property or to refurb a property. <laughs> that, and that episode didn't happen. And that didn't happen. I think that's the shortest. <laughs> shortest for you, longest for us. Um, no, mm-hmm. but I think this was just, we wanted to make sure that we release something on the first just really to say a big thank you to our listeners and our fans out there, right? Um, we wouldn't have made it through 2020 without you. Um, we've got 2021 to look forward to. We've got a lot in pl- um, planned for 2021, um, a lot of great topics, which hopefully will motivate you, inspire you, and educate you. So a lot to look forward to. And you guys, I'm going to enjoy another year of growing with you guys laughing with you guys and being annoyed at you guys especially the person <laughs> at the bottom and his timekeeping <laughs> well no it's good so guys thank you very much for joining us um happy new year we hope you've able to spend time with family loved ones whilst it may not have been the holiday season you planned or hoped for we hope you were able to find joy in the small things we look forward to a brighter happier healthier 2021 Stay safe, stay well, God bless. Yes, sir. Woo. Happy New Year, guys. Take off, take flight.